Pagsas nagno rin puso ding tao O tangga na kaing kulen ing yato Balumong balong at yunaing Pasko Mapilang kapabaluan kung pamamukulat ng pisambang maragol. Kaya kakalingwan ng pamanyulud face mask pa siya lulwalong multa pisamba. Magdala kong sariling payong nung sakaling muran o mapali kabang manenaya kimpila palug pisamba. Mayap na magdala ka rin sariling alkohol o sanitizer. Bayo ka lang upisang ban, dumalan kang body temperature check. Eye ka kalingwang kuwanan in kaya kayong contact tracing form. Tukyan may ang asher kilok, bangit turunan ang muka rin kamalyaring luklok. Magdala kang sariling panyulat para kang pamamilap ng kekang contact tracing form. Mapilan mong parishioners rin malyaring lungod pisamba. Tukyan tayo ang physical distancing kilug at kilwal pisamba. Panayon tala ding ashers para duwangan ding kekatamo ngayon. Alapang holding hands kabang pangan dyan ang ibami. Antimurin king pamamya kapayapan. Iyat-chat na din ang gamat o pala para kang pamananggap posture. Ela pa mo malyaring uman, apisan, o talnan din ang gang malayamahe at kimpisang ba. Kaiba't ni Misa, eh ay kakalingwa ni Bali din kaya kayong contact tracing form.
Sas nagnoring puso ding tao O tangga na kain kulenin yato Balumong balong at yunayin Pasko Let us pray the Angelus in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection, to the same Christ, our Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, 
is now, and will be forever. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Before we begin our Eucharistic celebration, may we remind all our Mass goers to please make sure to fill out the given contact tracing forms, write your complete and updated details on the form. The set numbers are found printed on the floor on the row assigned to you. Thank you. Good morning, brothers and sisters in Christ. We are gathered here to worship, to honor, to praise, and give thanks to God. In this celebration, let us include in our prayers the following intentions. For the thanksgiving of William Yao, the family of the late Felicidad Menensala, Waldorf and Rosal family, Chito and Tech Ocampo family, Marvin and Mai Banting and family, Apong Bising Pinlak and family, Avelina Banal, Nestor Banal, Florentina Alves, Adir David, Zenaida David, Sia Chong Yu and family, Teresita Young and family, Patrick Young and family, Christopher Young and family, Carlos Chu and family, Arturo Jun Jun Kalubad and family, Mendoza family, Roque family, Pangan family. For the physical and spiritual thanksgiving of Ang Apong Pio and Imang Auring Between and family, for the physical and spiritual complete healing of Carlos Galvan, Ansi Javier, Arnel Pinlap, Rosini David, for the special intentions and guidance of the Holy Spirit for the families and friends of Father Noli, Father Meg, Father Mark, and Father Marvin, Rodolfo and Vice Governor Lilia Nane Pineda and family, Governor Dennis and Yoli Pineda and family, Rosel Pineda, Cecilia and Miguel de Castro, Alan and Edna Vitug and family, Jeline Celso, Gladys and Claire Cochon, Dr. Jemeline Gueco, Grace Santa Ana, Joel Santa Ana, Juan Jose Santa Ana, Mr. and Mrs. Brian De Mata, Dean Aida, Matthew, Marcelo, Richard Galam, for the speedy, speedy recovery of Father Elmer Simbulan, Sister Agnes Guyena OCD, Christina Swing, Sel Timbol, Herminia Reyes, Jonel Lingat, Ashley Maria Kalingo Boyle, Len Leonard Ags Agadon, Jesusa Janisho. Let us remember our departed loved ones, especially Bishop Oscar Cruz, Monsignor Eugenio Mercado Jr., Monsignor Andres Serrano, Monsignor Odon Santos, Monsignor Francisco Lansang, Monsignor Rustico Cuevas, Father Venancio Samson, Father Jesus Mariano, Father Leobardo Montoya, Father Lorenzo Sarmiento, Father Herwin Bulaon, Monsignor Cosme Between, Monsignor Andres Between, Jose Joaquina Between, Antonio Dizon, Lourdes Dizon, Teresita Wilkerson, Johnny Uy, Aurora Nepomuceno Valdez, Ricardo Tan, Rodrigo Wong Gonzalez II, Alfonso Wong, Emilia and Santiago Gonzalez, Francisco de Choco, Natividad de Choco, Josefina Tolentino, Alfredo Chow, Chua Tang Eng, Yao Bun Keng, Edward Yao, Santiago Tai, Antonia Reyes, Maximo Chow, Simeona, Cecilia, Lolita, Vicky Manalili, Abraham Tayag, Sonia Omandal, Agapito Meneses, Jose Sensing Suarez, Sofia Suarez, Librado Sicat, Chito Reyes, Reynaldo Reyes, Juanito Belicario, Fernando Brameda, Redentor Magat, Eloy Antonio, Buenaventura Cruz, Misael Presas, Sherlyn Paras Antonio, Pasencia de los Reyes, Teresita Camaya, Teresita Punzalan, Fernanda Camaya, Carlito Mendoza, Manolito Gueco, Soul Nires the Gates of Heaven, Flora Sun, Francisco Sun, Amado Airo Nulud, Godofredo Cortez Manalese, Lourdes Castro Yusi, 
Ponciano Cortez Manalese, Conrado and Estrella, Edgardo, Ermelo, Efren Sr., Elizabeth and Bienvenido, Roman Perez, Ruben Villavicencio, Alejo Natividad, Jean Matthew Caadan, Corazon Ocampo, Brigido Ocampo, Antonio Juan Margarita, Bernardo Capati, Julita Capati, Adoracion Bada, and we pray for the souls of all departed, especially those who are in most need of God's mercy. Our Mass Presider is Reverend Father Nolasco L. Fernandez. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. The Lord is God and has given us light. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. If the people love you, love them. If they don't love you, love them. Because God is love. God is love. The first reading is about love and the gospel is about love. That God continued to love us in spite of. He loves us completely, totally, and unconditionally. And we have to imitate God because we were created in the image and likeness of God. For the many times that we have not loved God and our fellow men, let us ask God's mercy and forgiveness. You were sent to heal the contrite of heart. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. You came to call sinners. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. You are seated at the right hand of the Father to intercede for us. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who in the blessed childbearing of the Holy Virgin Mary kept the flesh of your Son, free from the sentence incurred by the human race, grant, we pray, that we who have been taken up into this new creation may be freed from the ancient taint of sin. We ask you this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the first letter of St. John. Beloved, let us love one another, because love is of God. Everyone who loves is begotten by God and knows God. Whoever is without love does not know God, for God is love. In this way, the love of God was revealed to us. God sent His only begotten Son into the world so that we might have life through Him. And this is love, not that we have loved God, but that He loved us and sent His Son as expiation for our sins. 
The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Lord, every nation on earth will adore you. Lord, every nation on earth will adore you. O God, with your judgment, endow the king, and with your justice, the king's son. He shall govern your people with justice, and your afflicted ones with judgment. Lord, every nation on earth will adore you. The mountain shall yield peace for the people, and the hills justice. He shall defend the afflicted among the people, save the children of the poor. Lord, every nation on earth will adore you. Justice shall flower in his days, and profound peace till the moon be no more. May he rule from sea to sea, and from the river to the ends of the earth. Lord, every nation on earth will adore you. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord has sent me to bring glad tidings to the poor and to proclaim liberty to captives. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Mark. Glory to you, O Lord. When Jesus saw the vast crowd, his heart was moved with pity for them. For they were like sheep without a shepherd. And he began to teach them many things. By now it was already late, and his disciples approached him and said, This is a deserted place, and it is already very late. Dismiss them so that they can go to the surrounding farms and villages and buy themselves something to eat. He said to them in reply, Give them some food yourselves. But they said to him, Are we to buy two hundred days wages worth of food and give it to them to eat? He asked them, how many loaves do you have? Go and see. And when they have found out, they said, Five loaves and two fish. So he gave orders to have them sit down in groups on the green grass. The people took their places in rows by hundreds and by fifties. Then, taking the five loaves, and the two fees, and looking up to heaven, he said the blessing, broke the loaves, and gave them to his disciples to set before the people. He also divided the two fees among them all. They all ate and were satisfied, and they picked up twelve weaker baskets full of fragments and what was left of this feast those who ate of the loaves were five thousand men the gospel of the lord praise to you lord jesus christ The first reading is about love. God is love. And He proved His love through Jesus Christ our Lord when He taught the vast crowd and He fed them. St. Thomas Merton, a Trappist monk, wrote, 
The Christian idea of God is contained in three words of the Apostle St. John. God is love. Sana po darating ang araw ang sasabihin, Man is love. God is love. It is the most important truth we can learn. God is love. And God is love is the summation of the Christian message. God loves us totally and completely and unconditionally. The nature of God is to love. Sana ganun din tayo. Our nature as human beings is to love and not to hate. Amen? Sana po makanyan eh. We were born to love and not to hate one another. He loves us no matter how good or bad we are. In Isaiah chapter 43, You are precious in my sight and important, for I have loved you. Nananing Diyos, eh? you are so precious and important, for I have loved you. This is the nature of God to love. And God cannot contradict Himself. He will never, never hate us. He will never, never commit sin. And St. John makes the point clearly when he says that love consists in this. In the first reading, not that we have loved God, but that, but that He has loved us first and has sent His Son as an offering for our sins. He loved us first. Siya po ang unang nagmahal sa atin. Wala tayong ginawa para mahalin tayo. Ang ginawa lang natin ay ang pagkakasala to commit sin. And yet, He loved us even though we are sinners. He loved us first, even though we are all sinners. It is not as if we did something to merit the sending of God's Son. God took the initiative while we, are, while we as a race were still sinners. Alam na alam mo po yung nagmamahal ng tunay. Halimbawa, yung mag-asawa, nag-away, alam mo kung sino ang nagmamahal. Yung unang lumalapit, siya po ang tunay na nagmamahal. Hindi po naghihintay. Ganon ang ginawa ng Diyos. Tayo po ang nagkasala. Siya ang unang lumapit. E eh tayo, hindi ganyan eh. Kung minsan, mamamatay na lang, hindi pa, hindi pa marunong magpatawad. Remember, my dear brothers and sisters, we have to imitate God. Because we were created in the image and likeness of God. We have to be like God. We have to love like God. We have to forgive like God. And Jesus taught that love, that love by His example throughout His life. Jesus continued to show this kind of love. And in the Gospel today, Jesus taught the vast crowd and fed them miraculously. So He taught them and He fed them. Napakaganda po 
tinuruan sila, nasa ilang sila, in the wilderness, there is no food, there is no shelter, walang pagkain, and Jesus fed them. Pinakain sila. Kaya nga, the gospel is about the multiplication of loaves and fish. Five loaves and two fish. No po? Uh, ilan ang kumain? Lalaki pa lang, limang libo. Hindi binibilang ang mga babae at saka mga bata. Kaya, with five loaves and two fish, He fed them miraculously. Alam po ninyo yung gospel na ito, the multiplication of loaves and fish. The gospel is the only miracle of Jesus. No po? Ito lang ang mala na ginawa na Jesus that is refort, uh, that was given to us by the four evangelists. Isa lang ang himala na ginawa ni Jesus that was really reported by the four evangelists, St. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Ito lang po. Lahat ng evangelista, the four evangelists, recorded, reported this miracle. Ano pong ibig sabihin nito? No? Anong ibig sabihin nito? Ito po ay napakahalaga ibig sabihin. Bible scholars are one in saying that the story of the multiplication of loaves has details that allude to the Holy Eucharist. It is the foreshadowing of the Holy Eucharist. Tignan po ninyo nung kinuha niyang tinapay, anong ginawa ni Jesus? He blessed them, He broke them, and gave them. Sa misa, ganun din. He took the bread, blessed them, He broke them. It is the foreshadowing of the Holy Eucharist, ang Santa Misa. Po? It foreshadowed the Holy Eucharist, which after more than 2,000 years became the heart of all Christian worship. Kaya nga palagi ko pong sinasabi, kapag tayo nagsisimba, kaya kapampangan masantingi, potang sisimba tamo sa samba tamo. Dimdamiya po, when we attend Holy Mass, we worship God. We worship God. And what Jesus did for the crowd, He continues to do for us in every Mass. In the Gospel, He taught them the he taught the vast crowd and He fed them. Jesus, in the Holy Eucharist, we read the Word of God. He speaks to us. He teaches us. And He feeds us. In the Gospel, He taught them and fed them in the Mass. He teaches us and He feeds us. He gives His body and blood. He teaches us to the Scriptures and feed us. And He feeds us with His body and blood. And through the Holy Eucharist, Jesus continues to multiply bread. His presence, God is with us because He loves us. And after being taught and fed by Jesus, 
let us now become like Jesus. Makinabang tamo, niya makinabang kasanting naning kapampangan, may kinabang ka. Niya itong may kinabang ka at ingkang nanabangnan. Ustong eka may kinabang, alakang pakinabang. Alakang nanabangnan. Amen? Niya makinabang tamo po nung alata mo mo rin maragula kasalanan. Then, after receiving Holy Communion, if we, if we say, God is love, pagkatapos mong tinanggap si Jesus, man is love. Kailangan love tamo muna naman. Because we were created in the image and likeness of God. My dear brothers and sisters, we have to love like God, like Jesus, because we will be judged by the love that we show to God and to our fellow men. We will be judged by the love we have shown. In lugod, napuka important din eh. Yeah. In my introduction, when people love you, love them. When people don't love you, love them still. Because God loves us. Love is a noble act of self-giving. When you love, you have to give. Ganyan po ang sinabi ng, ng, ng first reading. No? Whoever is without love does not know God, for God is love. In this way, the love of God was revealed to us. God sent His only begotten Son into the world so that we might have life through you. If we will love, love gives life. He gave His only begotten Son so that we might have life, the life of God. Sung lulugod ka, di nan meng biye in kaya kang luluguran. Anya pinung mikalugod ka, iko ang miya sawa, di nan meng biye in asawa mo, e may diri nan problema, o tagad siyang mati. In lulugod, di nan meng biye in luluguran mo. Nya pinay Jesus, He came to give us life, life everlasting. O ita po yung lugod, di nan meng biye. E problema. Pero itong dininanak ang problema, luguran may pamurin. Why do we have to, to love like Jesus? Because love is a noble act of self-giving. It is self-giving. You give yourself so that that person may have life. Love is a noble act of self-giving. The more you love, the more you will give. And the more you give, you lose yourself. And when you lose yourself, you just end up complete. It is in giving that we receive. You can give without love, but when you give, when you love, you have to keep. Amen? So, lulugod ka ting kang babie. Love. Alway tang kabid mong kabid. It is always what you can keep and what you can share. Alway tang kabid mong kabid. Nya po tang lulugod ka, daka lang mama ko kaya kaya. Mama ko. Papunta, ketang. 
But when you give and you lose of yourself, you just end up complete. When you love, you become complete. Just like Jesus. Amen. Only God the Father can satisfy the hunger of the heart and of the spirit. So we place our needs before Him. Let our response be, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the church may awaken in its members a hunger and thirst for the bread of eternal life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That we may realize that the longings of the heart cannot be satisfied by the pursuit of worldly success or material comfort. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who spend their time useless, searching for joy and happiness in the wrong way, may find their right direction and purpose in life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick and the handicapped may receive support and consolation from family and friends. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who have died may share in the eternal banquet of heaven. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. In silence of our hearts, let us pray for our personal intentions. Almighty Father, you have given us the bread from heaven as food for our pilgrim journey. Guide our steps in the way of justice and peace. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for to your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. By this mystery of this water and wine, may we come to share the divinity of Christ who humbled himself to share our humanity. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for to your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Pray, brethren, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy Church. O God, whose only begotten Son has appeared in our very flesh, grant, we pray, that we may be inwardly transformed through Him, whom we recognize as outwardly like ourselves, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, 
forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for today you have re revealed the mystery of our salvation in Christ as a light for the nations. And when he appeared in our mortal nature, you made us new by the glory of his immortal nature. And so with angels and archangels, with thrones and dominions, and with all the hosts and powers of heaven, we sing the hymn of your glory as without end we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full, are full of your glory. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes, who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, and Florentino, our Bishop, Passiano, our Bishop Emeritus, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection 
and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the blessed apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him and with Him and in Him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to pray. Our, Our Father, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be always with you. And with your spirit. Let us offer its other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Peace be with you. May this mingling of the body and blood of Christ bring us all to everlasting life. Lamb of God. You take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God. You take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof. But only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. The body of Christ. Amen. A gentle reminder for orderly reception of Holy Communion. Please remain in your places and wait for the priest or EMDC to approach you. Those who will receive the Holy Communion, please remain standing with your hands extended together. Those who will not receive the Holy Communion, you may be seated or kneel in prayer. The priest already had said the body of Christ, and we have already responded, Amen. So there is no need for any word when the priest or EMDC approaches you. Thank you.
Because of that great love of His with which God loved us, He sent His Son in the likeness of sinful flesh. Let us pray. O God, who touch us through our partaking of your sacrament, work, we pray, the effects of its power in our hearts, that we may be made fit to receive your gift through this very gift itself, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Oratio Imperata God, our Father, we come to you in our need to ask your protection against the COVID-19 that has disturbed and even claimed lives. We pray that you guide the people tasked to find cures for this disease and to stem its transmission. Protect the medical experts that they may minister to the sick with competence and compassion. We pray for those afflicted. May they be restored to health soon. Protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Grant us the gift of contrition that we may be sorry with a sorrow of love for all our sins and the sins of humankind throughout the ages. Give us the grace in this trying time to work for the good of all and to help those in need. We implore you to stop the spread of this virus and to save us from our fears. Grant all this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers, O glorious and blessed Virgin. Amen. Our Lady, health of the sick, Pray for us. Saint Raphael the Archangel. Pray for us. Saint Rock. Pray for us. Saint Lorenzo Ruiz. Pray for us. Saint Pedro Calonsod. Pray for us. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass has been offered. We now go to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. To maintain physical distancing, may we kindly request everyone to stay on your seats and wait for our asherets. They will be guiding you on your way to our exit doors. May we also remind you to drop your contact tracing forms at the drop boxes located near our exit doors. Thank you.
Mapilang kapabaluan kin pamamukulat ng pisambang maragot. Eye kakalingwan ng pamanyulud face mask pa siya lulwalong muta pisamba. Magdala kong sariling payong nung sakaling muran o mapali kabang manenaya kin pila palug pisamba. Mayap na magdala ka rin sariling alkohol o sanitizer. Bayo ka lang upisang ban, dumalan kang body temperature check. Eye ka kaling buwang kuwanan in kaya kayong contact tracing form. Tukyan may ang Asher Kilo, bang ituro na ng muka rin kamalyaring luk-luk. Magdala kang sariling panyulat para kang pamamila ng kaya kang contact tracing form. Mapilan mong parishioners rin malyaring lumub isang ba. Tukyan tayo ang physical distancing kilub at kilwal isang ba. Panayon tala din nga shirts para duangan din kekatamong ngayon. Alapang holding hands kabang panga dyan in ibami. Antimurin king pamamya kapayapan. Iyat-chat na din ang gamat o palat para kang pamananggap host siya. Ela pa mo malyaring uman, apisan, putal nanding hanggang malayamahit, kimpisang ba? Kaiba't ni Misa, eye kakalingwan ni Balik din kaya kayong contact tracing form. Maglakad ting karalong luma, 
Malu. 